What's going on ladies and gentlemen? Welcome back for another shave. Tonight's shaving soap of choice is going to be Noble Lauder Plunder. Haven't used this soap in a while. Nice uh, springtime scent and could be uh, used in the fall as well. Uh, here are the scent notes. We got bay, grog, spice, rose, lime, grapefruit, vetiver, and cannon smoke. Um, I definitely get the smokiness of the cannon smoke. The other sense, what am I getting here? I don't get the vetiver at all. I get the bay. I don't really get the lime. Yeah, mostly just the cannon smoke. Very smoky scent. Not too smoky, but you know, powdery, like kind of like a gunpowder type of smoky scent. And no Otter is some really, really, really good soap. It's really hard to get too. They sell out really quick. Every time they come out with a new soap, it's frustrating. I always try to like get in on it and it sells out so fast. I got two Noble Otter soaps in it then. I got this one and I got the Orbit. And Orbit is a really, 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 really nice scent. All right, got a good healthy load from the brush here. You can see how pasty that is. That's gonna need some more water. I'm gonna go ahead and dunk the brush in and get it dialed into the consistency I like. Yeah, this is a nice scent. I think I like the the plunder just a little better than the orbit. They came out with a scent a little while back. I think it's like called Vanille or... I can't remember what the scent is, is called. And I'm wondering if it's a type of vanilla tobacco, tobacco-y type scent. Those are the scents I really, really enjoy. Need water, need some more water. How's everybody's week going? It's Thursday night here. Or not Thursday night, it's Wednesday night. I'm a day ahead of myself. Maybe wishful thinking. Looking forward to the weekend. Gonna get out and play some golf. We're gonna go try a course out that I've never played at before, out in Lancaster County. Need some more water. That looks good to me. Get all the lather off my hands. I got lather all over my fingers. So I hope everybody is having a nice week, having good shaves. The weather here has been really, really warm. And dry. Last week we had a lot of storms come through. Had a couple of severe storms come through too. We were out of power for a couple of days. All right, razor I'm gonna go with tonight is the CB Heistrand. Here we go, pass number one. This razor might need a new edge soon. <clears throat> I'm struggling a little bit uh, in the mustache area there and a little bit in the beard. 
or in the chin. I've got thicker growth there, so, and I've got about four days growth. So that could be why too. Yeah, definitely needs a new edge. A little tuggy. I'm gonna rinse up real quick. I've had a lot of shaves with that razor. I got that razor a little over a year ago and it's still the original edge. I got it sent to me from uh, Mati Lindholm. He honed it up for me. And it's been, the edge kept on it for a real long time. And now I think I need to have it touched up a little bit. So I converted my wife, my wife to wet shaving. The other day, <clears throat> She called me into the room and she was like, I got some bumps on my leg, like a rash or something going on. And she showed me and it was razor burn. So I was like, I got some stuff you can use to take care of that razor burn. So I got her the bump patrol and I got her some, uh, some post shave balm to put on her legs. And I was like, I got a shaving soap you can try too. And I gave her my uh, Ariana and Evans uh, Summer Fig. Gave her the splash to rub on her legs. And my Zingari Man Post Shave Balm. And she enjoyed using it so much that I ordered her the Zingari Man Post Shave Balm and I gave her my uh, Summer Fig Soap. Having your spouse uh, into wet shaving can be a blessing and a curse, I believe. <laughs> Here we go, second pass. I could probably get more, uh, get away with buying more, especially if she's into it. But if she doesn't buy more, she'll come in and start stealing my stuff, <laughs> which is cool. All right, I think that's gonna do it. Yeah, 
yeah, not a bad shave tonight. Edge was a little tuggy. I'm going to send it out. Have it refresh. And then it'll be as good as new again. All right. So I'm going to finish off the shave tonight with some Oleo Soap Works Windy City Barbershop. This uh, scent has a smoky scent to it too. I believe this one has a gunpowder note to it. Whoop! Knocking my aftershave over. I didn't spill any though, believe it or not. There's not a whole lot left. As I was saying, this has a gunpowder note to it, which will complement the cannon smoke note very nicely. And it's slightly mentholated. Pick up my cap. And <clears throat> gonna put some Zingari Man Post Shave Balm on, two pumps, and I'll be all good. And that's gonna do it, ladies and gentlemen. Hope you guys all have a great week. Take care. See you again.